Hi there. Um, lately a lot of AVG users have been experiencing a problem with their update manager. So basically if you were to try and update your virus database in the two usual ways by clicking update now or using a schedule update, the update would fail and it would tell you something like the update failed due to a missing bin file. Now, I myself had this problem, and the first thing I did was reinstall my AVG antivirus, but that didn't fix the problem at all, so I did some internet research, and I found out that the problem wasn't in my computer at all. The problem is actually in the AVG server that my computer connects to when downloading the updates. So, until AVG fixes the problem with its server, AVG users won't be able to automatically download updates and therefore they won't be protected against the newest threats. But there still is a way to manually download new updates and in this video I'm going to show you how to do that with AVG antivirus. So the first thing you want to do is go to your documents and create a new folder. Just right click in an empty space, go to new and click on folder. I'm going to name mine AVG. Next thing you're going to do is go online to the AVG update page and I will provide a link to this page in the video description. Now once you're here scroll down and you'll see a list of new updates. The ones that we're looking for are the AVI and the IAVI file because those two are the basic virus definition updates. Now you want to make sure that the date is fresh because you don't want anything old and if the date isn't fresh then you can just uh, reload the website and you can refresh it. Now what you want to do is download these two files to the folder that you just created. Once you've downloaded them, open up your AVG user interface, go to Tools, and click on Update from Directory. Now find the folder where you just saved those two update files, click on it, and click OK. And that should start the manual update. Once the update is complete, you can delete that folder that you created because once those updates are installed they're all news. So just go ahead and delete it. So that's how you manually install updates in AVG. So until AVG fixes the problem with its server this is the only way that you can download updates and be safe from the newest threats. Anyways, thanks for watching the video. I hope it was helpful. Bye.